doing some digging, and I found even more of the scariest videos that the internet has to offer. How scary, you ask? <laughs> Foolish diaper baby! So scary! Fear is subjective. We'll see if you actually shit your pants or not. This one's called 2H32, which is like two hours, 32 minutes. And it's the name of the channel as well. I like the vibe of this. It just seems cool and the start is... Oh, a pair of good headphones and your head will be shaking. But I don't know... Oh God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The blood! I've seen enough. <laughs> I just heard the intro and somebody said it was scary, but I didn't know we were going to see wiki feet. Ugh. Oh, Jesus. This feels like someone's actual, like, murder tape. Is that a gimp? What am I watching? Ew! Someone got their hand in the ketchup! I have no idea what's going on. Bro, how are you gonna make a door opening scare me? I literally do it all day, every day. This dude looks like he's walking on the moon. I don't even know if what I'm looking at half the time is human. That's <laughs> why so I say every day in the mirror. Thank God, finally a demon closes a door. They're always opening them, but they never close them. They're so rude. That was it? I feel like someone put a camera inside their brain, went to sleep, and had a nightmare, and this is what came out. I don't know what I watched, and the fact that I don't know what actually happened, and a lot of what I was looking at seemed so natural and, like, real, actually feels scarier than showing anything. It's the unknown that scares me the most. They have a lot of videos on their channel, and it feels like a lot of them are the same thing. Look at these thumbnails. Okay, so that was the first one they made five years ago. This one's called Door. All right, doors don't scare me. Somehow you made it scary. Let's see what their most popular ones are. Okay, Blackout. A year ago. I hope you're still making stuff. That'd be sad to see creativity like this stop. Okay, let's see if we can make sense of this one. Is there like a through thread that I'm supposed to be following? Okay, windows. We all have them. Why- why is nothing happening? Whoa, that's really subtle. Oh! You might have to boost the audio and the edit. Because it's very faint. with the mask again? No, thank you. 
I have enough problems in the house, I don't need any from outside. Uh... Did they make the rain stop? What am I even looking at? Looks like the arse end of a crow. A big one. Whoa, the whole place shook. <laughs> what is that? I thought it was a person. It had like tendrils now. Nah. Nah, you know I said it was sad the creativity like this has stopped? Maybe it's good. <laughs> Jesus. I don't know what's going on in these, but I do like it a lot. That was- that was cool. Okay, shake it off. Shake it off. That was- that was scary, but they were short, so you know they have to come to an end, and you can get out, and you can go make yourself a sandwich. This was 12 minutes, and a lot of people said that this was very scary, and it has 2.7 million views, so I'm assuming a lot of people agree. Um, and it's called My House Walkthrough. The sound of the wind woke me up in the middle of the night. A typhoon is in Japan. That's scary enough already. This is my room. Okay, things have looked better. The tatami mats are terribly damaged. This is the longest hallway in my house. Okay. This is Hina doll room. Dude, you need to invest in... Well, I was gonna say invest in some lights, but you did say this was a typhoon. This is altar and ancestors. This is a picture from around the time of World War II. I feel like this is just asking for trouble. Having an altar with like old pictures of people who are likely gone. You're just giving ghosts a doorway and opening it up and being like, come on in! When I open this Fusuma sliding door, there is another hallway. Whoa, that is long. Right room is doll room. So when you say doll room, this room was closed up by my grandfather. Everything is so destroyed. This is a picture of my mother when she was a child. Okay, old timey pictures, always creepy. This is my great grandmother. Why do I hear like chanting? You hear that? This is the bathroom. Dude, you are gonna get some sort of venereal disease just living in that house. I hear a sutra. What's a sutra? Is that the, like, chanting that I'm hearing? My grandfather's always listening to sutra from the radio. I need to look it up. I don't know what it is. Sutra is literally rule or aphorism or a collective of them. Sanskrit literature includes many, so, so it's like a reading of something. That's, okay, that's all I need to know, the basics. I don't know if it's religious or not. Oh, the wall peels off from the ceiling when it rains. This does not sound like a good place to be. I mean, better than outside. This is the longest hallway in my house. Wait! Have we looped? This is the altar again! A typhoon is in Japan! What the fuck?! The tatami mats are terribly damaged. Oh, this is cool. When I open this Fusuma sliding door, there's another hallway. It's the same hallway! I didn't even realize! It's just slightly changed the second time around. It's a picture from around the time of World War II. And the picture of your grandmother 
Yeah, dress room, doll room. That's cool. Goes up on my grandfather when I turn left. At the end, there's another hallway. This is some PT stuff. Oh, now I see where you're hiding the edits. Interesting. This is the longest hallway in my house. Here we go again. Do you think it's the longest hallway in your house because you're stuck in an infinite loop? Maybe. This is grandmother's bedroom. This room was closed up my gr by my grandfather. I think this dude's in purgatory. Or in some sort of like death phase. That's an edit cut right there. The roof leaks. Is it? I don't know if it's staying the same though or if it's changing. The wall peels off the ceiling when it rains. Uh huh. When I turn left at the end, there's another hallway. And there's where he hit an edit again. That's not the point. Why am I talking about that? Oh, wait, we're in the bathroom now. Uh, is that peeling or hair? There are rat nests above the ceiling. I'm not, too, I'm not feeling great about this house. I'm just going to say it. Remember this Christmas sliding door? There's another hallway. I wish... That floor is different, right? It was red last time, now it's all white. Oh, the room's open. This room is the dress room. There are a lot of dress from my grandmother. My grandmother is not here. This look like everything's covered in blood. The holes eaten by insects have turned black like blood stains. Oh. Oh, Jesus. It's my grandmother's mannequin. Always, always great to just have a mannequin lying there. Oh, that fucking doll face! I really don't like this. It's making me so uncomfortable. We're only halfway through. Oh, I feel like I'm stuck in this loop with you now. This is the doll room. Are we going into the doll room at any point? Oh, yeah, we are. There are various types of dolls. None of them good. The tatami mats are terribly damaged. Yep. Everything is. The doll has been left there for decades. So creepy. The wall peels off from the ceiling when it rains. This is great grandmother and grandfather. Cool. I'm sure they're not going to haunt you at all. This kind of like this sutra going on in the background constantly. Okay, we're going back into the hallway again. What is different this time, kids? Spot the difference. Sure, my mother was your child. Okay, faces are scrawled out. <laughs> Getting better. Grandfather's always listening to Sutra from the radio. All the pictures are blacked out now. Oh god, I hope there's not like someone standing in the bathroom at some point. This is the Hina doll room. Wait, I thought the dress room was on the left. Jesus, no one has been in this room for a very long time. This is different from before. These dolls are rotten. Oh, they're so creepy. Empress doll is rotten too. My grandmother is not here. I think she is.
This is altar and ancestors. Mm -hmm. This is my picture of my grandfather. Face is scratched out. I'm sure that means nothing. This is a picture of a demon. Oh, the mannequin moved! God, that sutra's getting... Is it getting louder? This is grandmother's bedroom. This room has no taste. Well, don't go look in the walls or anything. Grandmother's shoes. If I see feet in some shoes, it's... What was that? Ceiling has rotten and fallen away. Dude, there's hair everywhere. It's like spilling out of things. Look at it. There are many mouse turds. <laughs> we keep seeing that hair lying around everywhere. I hear a sutra. Oh, this is making me so uncomfortable. There's gonna be like a, like a black shadowy figure standing somewhere at some point. I can just feel it, and I'm gonna lose my collective shit. And I didn't really have it all together in the first place. There's a picture from around the time of World War II, uh-huh. There's that hair again! It was sticking out at the bottom of the picture this time. This is the bathroom, it's covered in blood. There's a doll in the sink. It is PT! What is that? My grandfather is here! Oh, God! That's worse than the black shadowy figure of a ghost in the corner! He keeps saying my grandmother's not here, but granddad's just chilling in the tub. Now the door's all red. <laughs> oh, God! Enter the fifth dimension, where it's nothing but bullshit. My grandfather's always listening to Sutra from the radio. It changed, though. I mean, the sound, not the walls. Obviously, the walls have changed. The sound of the wind woke me up in the middle of the night. Are you sure it wasn't the impending dread? Of death? Right, and I suppose it's him. Oh, is that the fan? Jesus! The holes eaten by the insects have turned black to blood stains. Why is everything like covered in paper? <laughs> this is my room. Cozy, huh? Do you like it? Do you like what I've done with the place? There's a typhoon in Japan, just thought I'd let you know again. Tommy mats are terribly damaged. You can't even see them anymore, bro. Sweet dreams. Um, what the fuck did I just watch? That was so freaky. I mean, apart from showing the granddad in the tub, almost nothing happened, like, overtly scary. It was just a trip through this dude's house, we did what, like 15 loops of the house? And stuff progressively got worse, stuff moved. I don't know what that means. Yeah, the transition from grandmother is not here to grandmother is here scared me better than any jump scare could. Exactly. It just built that sense of dread and atmosphere and fear the whole way throughout that you were expecting something massive to happen and when it didn't, it was just showing things so nonchalantly. It was just so normal to them that that was scarier than anything. Like, here I am, just Here's my death relative. Dum de dum de dum. That's scary. <laughs> grandmother is not here. Cam, grandmother is here. Panic. So scary. Somebody theorized that they wake up during the storm and pass through the sliding door altar. 
I believe this symbolizes that the main character has passed away most likely during the storm and is now making the slow descent to join his grandmother and grandfather. The subtitles are surface level observations echoes in his mind from life. That's a cool theory. I like that a lot. It's like his brain is so slowly coming to realization that they're dead. And then actually seeing the physical manifestation of the grandfather there, even though the grandfather's dead. God, that was really cool. I like that so much. Okay, last one. This is a lot of views as well, and people were speaking very highly of it, and it was uploaded very recently. January 7th, so it's like almost two weeks old at this point, and it has six and a half million views. That's how you know you're in for a banger. Uh, but it's found footage as well, and that squeezes my nipples ever so delicately. This is my jam. Camera. Oh, I thought that was a real thing. Okay. Action. <laughs> Alright, cut. Cut. That was good. That was good, guys. Alright, uh, that was good. I'm thinking we get a wide angle and then we're done. Okay? Alright? Yeah, cool. cool. Like, how much further? Like, uh, a little more. Right. A little more. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. Whoa, did he just fall through the <laughs> ground? Backrooms, a short film by Kane Parsons. <laughs> okay. Hello? Hello? This immediately looks like an indie horror game. You know how you go through like a million hallways? What is this? Seriously? Hello? <laughs> what Someone was there? that? Keep filming, bro. I want to see this. I know you're probably going to die, but think of the content. Whoa, this location's dope. Something's gonna go by. Oh, never mind. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, sure, why not? If you're in this hell hole, go through the tiny hole in the wall. It's oddly camp for someone who fell through the ground. Who knows, maybe he banged his head and he's dead. Can anybody hear me? Hello? Absolute nightmare. Damn it. Whoa, what was that? Wait, did I see something down that dark hallway? I did. It's gone now. Go, Jason. There's arrows on the wall. Go that way. I'm sure it's not nothing bad. It really reminds me of an indie horror game. Okay. okay. <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? What does it say? Don't move. Don't move, stay still. the hair on my legs stand up. What was that thing? It looked like a pencil drawing. <laughs> Jesus. 
this dude? Oh, that's a bad sign. Whoa! Whoa! Holy fuck! Yeah, just do it. Just do it. Oh god, anything's better than that. Oh, break your legs or anything. Holy shit, that was scary. Just go. After seeing that, I would not walk anywhere. Ooh. Oh, it's gonna show up. Stop messing with the lights. At least the lighting in here is nicer. You're not stuck in yellow hell. Never mind, this is much worse. <laughs> Holy shit. What the fuck is this place? What the fuck is going on? Dude, you were awfully calm for someone who got chased by a stick figure. Whoa! Holy shit! What the f This isn't real. This isn't real. See if you can make the jump. This, this isn't real. Definitely an indie horror game. Oh, an exit. A fire exit, too. I'm sure this leads to outside, right? I'm sure once he goes through that door, he's safe. Sound. He gets back to his friends and fil finishes filming his student film. Nah, never mind. <laughs> Show it again. I want to see it. Oh, it's going to come at you. What the fuck? Oh god, the sound is so good! What is that? It looks like an old lady with crutches. Cool slide. Oh, God! Holy fuck! God damn! That was really, really good. That's one of my favorite ones I think we've watched in this series so far. Oh! No way! They're the ones that made the Attack on Titan stuff! That's fucking awesome! I love their- I saw it on TikTok! This one, like the Declaration of War? 
I don't know if I showed it to you guys in a video, but this like the speech like it's an actual thing that happened Like what would it look like in real life? And then Aaron pops out the top. It's so cool. Making it feel real like that, like the actual panic and pandemonium that would happen if a titan showed up and like seeing it in real life and the scale of it is so scary. Oh my god, that makes so much sense now. Kane Pixels, you make some really, really good stuff. I'm very impressed. The fact that you're able to like sit at home and make something like this with like tools just at your disposal, probably from a computer just at your house is such stellar work and is exactly why I love doing the job that I do because it's like the amount of possibility there is doing this just from your own room. It's just so cool. Anyway, that's going to do it for me. What a good episode. Holy shit. That, um, that house tour one and this one are two that I'm definitely going to remember for a very long time. Those were super effective. Thank you guys for watching this. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you got scared by it, good. That's, it's supposed to do that. It's called Scariest Videos on the Internet. What are you going to do? Sit back, pick your teeth. If you haven't already, suggest me some videos and also subscribe. It's free. It's one button click down below. Super easy to do. Do it now. And then you can be up to date for whenever I upload another one of these videos and scare the pants off of you.